of and any feedback. Yeah, I'll see because where I Because Toysi spawned without radio and without programmer, and they magic yep. did. I think that's a, that's an unlock. <laughs> I'll see what I can do. Thunk. Yeah, I will see that's what a... I can do about those kits. I think it's a T far setting. I just gotta go find that T far setting, and it's a gigantic pain in the butt. All right. You're hot, making an angel, by the uh, way. Or, oof, that was that was bad. That was very bad. Um, I've muted yeah. my mic. I got yeah. so nice so. Yes, you've definitely muted your mic. Yeah. Um, I was asking. Are you supposed to have the micro daggers then, or not? <coughs> It wasn't unlocked versus the sheet, his document, so I would say no. Yeah, definitely. It's, it's, it's because of a spawn glitch. I'll fix yeah, it for next time. I even spawned him twice and it still gave me. Beep. Okay, let's see. So, uh, a few things I gotta do here. Um, let's play Keeper of Sajuk. And I gotta now also adjust the... Uh, Hey, I don't know what we're supposed to be taking, so I'm thinking these black uniforms. Uh, what did we take last time? I don't know, I didn't play last time. I don't know what we took last time. <coughs> Excuse me. Took. What is it? We took anything with a black shirt. The map is I GOS. Yeah, we did black shirt and boonies, but then again, we're the only ones that wear this. There's a I'm oh, thinking I... these black uniforms. And let's go to the mission. Um, not a mission. That not all of them. Happen, but I add so what, in like this? the main the CIA yeah, operatives spawn to the failure of the 1953 Salama. Raid and no, attempt to rescue a no. To rescue. Uh, no, no. Why aren't we all bringing suppressed MP or uh, M3s though? No. To rescue. Here's what I complained about. I'd like to observe very carefully the uh, M field and its magazine. Wait, what? Wait, what? Hello. <laughs> we could all just bring PCRSs and grab on them with AT guns. So I have a sniper and an MP44 in my backpack. I know, I'm gonna do AT on a skelly. You wanna do AT? Become so AT. I'm just gonna bring a stick, whatever. So if you guys want, I have examples of the uh, what the gorillas look like again. Uh, they're outside, and then I have a brief room outside. And I'll give you your brief, then their brief. No rage cards? Oh, did I should never mind. I haven't even looked yet. Did you forget the range cards again? Did I forget the range cards? I don't think so, but then again, maybe I copied an arsenal, Ron. Are we all set to medics? Yes. Before you freak out, I sponsored Abraham, okay? Okay. Uh, there's no range cards. Probably because I copied the arsenal run. Alright, stand by. Uh, uh, Liru, you so... didn't change the M14s, right? No, no I did not. Oh. I guess I'm going to wait for the brief before I decide what I'm taking. Yeah. Because I feel like a suppressed gun might be useful for what we're doing. Uh, Grease Gun is amazing. Yes, the Grease Gun is even better. It's beyond amazing. I used it last time and it was glorious. It just depends because, well, this is mostly jungle, so it'll be close quarters shit, so I'm just gonna bring that. Jungle Mag! So, Tempesto. I was thinking of running with a sniper and a fucking MP44. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Uh, alright, it's added. If you go in and out of the arsenal, it's there. What, did you swap the M14s out? No, the range cards. Not range cards. Be fine. Oh, I've seen double. Uh, <clears throat> alright, everyone's um, okay with it. I sponsored Frost 993. That's good. Back in a sec. I'm gonna grab some extra medical shit, I guess. Fine, play this off. 
All right, guys, I'm on a switch unit, so uh, let me know what you guys grab. I'll get you the uh, brief in a bit. Uh, your transport vics are in the base and just outside this wall. Make sure you grab medical. Uh, remember, they do have PTRSs that can merc your trucks pretty easily, so be careful about that. But this op isn't really meant to have any PvP elements. But it can still happen, so I still have to give you a brief. Uh, only talk to me if this unit's actually, like, moving around and shit, because I'm using a command to take care of it, because this isn't my real unit. Because if I were to teleport over here, the AI would shoot me. Big cack. Wow, that broke my Zeus. Uh, we use the tiger stripe black. That's a really rare glitch. What are those? No, but I'd just drop your rolls. They like that, cinnamon, that completely they're... broke cinnamon my rolls, ability to load in the sniffer. Okay, orange, one like second. Orange mm. flavoring. That's rare. Usually you gotta die to do that. <laughs> right, oh, Dead Walker, I feel that. Yeah, we got any work done, but yeah, time has progressed. I'm gonna go for a piss, and I'll come back, and I'm gonna hope the squads have flushed out. Of it. We did not need to know that. Just say that you're going, please. Alright. Mm. Alright, boys, I'm gonna go take all oh, the power. Fat fucking dumb. Oh. <laughs> Shut up, you're the enemy. Yeah, there are. Well, yeah, there are. The here grenades are the same thing. The her. Yeah, 43 fragmentation SS. Yeah. Um, anyone carrying extra ammo? Alright. What do you need ammo for? Uh, what gun? What gun? The grease gun. Yeah, yeah, I can grab some extra ammo. Because I'm carrying a lot of medical, so I'll do medic shit. I got, uh, uh 10 extra, 10 extra max. Examples of the gorilla dude somewhere, but I don't... I don't see him either. I, I went around and don't see him anywhere. Oh, here. No? Don't see him. Fuck, they're it. Oh, wait. Liru disconnected at some point, I think. Liru disconnected at one point, so he just returned, so he's probably doing something. He's probably re garrisoning shit again. Okay. Here, since you don't want to walk five feet, there they are. We, we didn't know where they were! Oh. I see you, Liru. The hell? The ammo for the M3. Uh, and the ammo for the goose dog. Where'd it go? Or doesn't have ammo for the hell. Gracias, senor. If someone wants to carry ammo for me, I would, be, I would appreciate it. <clears throat> I carry the goose dog too. I gotta re-garrison oh. all these stupid idiots that keep climbing on the fucking ladders! What the fuck? No! Ooh. Oh, you yeah. piece Tem, of what shit. What extra ammo do you want? A, uh, hey, H-E-A-T. Should we make, a, should we make uh, a, some sort of a semi-deal here that everybody, they take an automatic and use it to trust them three? That would wall, Mate, we'll need someone with more firepower, like an MG, though. We'll need at least one. 5-0, <coughs> Jack. Uh, I mean, it depends on, again, I want to hear the beat first. Seek and stick an MMG-42, yeah. though. I'm, I'll, we I'll, do need the brief. Yeah, we need the brief. You guys want the brief? Uh, I... Yeah, we'll, we'll take our brief not, whenever you're ready. Not everybody's in here yet, but I guess. Oh, when you're ready, we'll. You can fill in people later, but yeah. Yeah. Know. I mean, it's it's really really simple. Uh, I'll need you to come over to me though. Hold on, oh, no, give me a minute. Hold on, let me grab that notepad from the audience. Oh God. Nope. Give me one second. These AI are fucking retarded. Not again! <laughs> uh, man with his I want a Damn notepad in my Stay up there, you piece of frickety fracking work! <laughs> Stay! What? How are you broken already, Tempesto? What the fuck? No! <laughs> Even overrides Garrison, I absolutely hate it. Stay! Stay up there with your You're stupid pistol. <laughs> yeah, circle around because you don't know how to leap. Hey, 
closes it. Yes, that's your safety. That's literally the safety on a grease gun. It's closed the dust. It's closed the ejection port. How does it open? Back again. Just press that. F again. I'm carrying okay, 12 I, magazines I, I, for grease gun. I, I feel I bad now. I'm carrying oh, 10. Oh, thank God. So okay, I only managed culture. to get 12 because I'm also carrying extra rounds for attempts uh, cold and stuff. Cold yeah, Because that's not in bad. my backpack, I also have this. Yes. Uh, I have a couple of grenades. I have a bunch of grenades, but my this main gun is actually is I got really the fun to shoot. Mm -hmm. Really fun to shoot. Yeah, I'm but, carrying uh, three. Are you guys ready for brief? Uh, okay. Let's go. Is the magical adventure flying through the sky? Okay. So our actual uh, AO got cut off here, so I'll tell you where we are via grid ref. We are at 080192. Just don't mark it in global because bad guys will see it. 080192. 080192. Yep. So we're there. And then everything on this map is accurate. So, uh, to break everything down, uh, first off, image all the way over here. This is what the bad guys are. This is another image of what the friendly guys are. Uh, knowing what the friendly guys look like is going to be important today because you're going to be rescuing four of them. Uh, this op is supposed to take place post-1953 uh, botched Salama raid in Guatemala. Uh, historically, uh, a lot of guerrillas were captured, including some embedded CIA agents. So, it is assumed that the CIA mounted a rescue op for those agents uh, on that botched raid. So, today we are going to be rescuing them from a prison. The specific picture of the prison is available uh, on this image on the far left. Uh, if you were to open your maps, uh, the specific prison complex is the one with the radio tower at 097180 numpad 7. It's that one specifically out of that cluster of four compounds. So. Let me explain today's operation. So, uh, the enemy forces are spawning at the Green 4 uh, marker, at least the enemy players. Uh, that's to simulate where they have a large uh, garrison. And obviously that is in between us and the prison. So, our guerrilla friends are going to be running a distraction op in the town of Mutar, marked with the blue flag on the south. Uh, the warning markers on this map represent positions that are garrisoned by the enemy. Uh, the northern one is obviously where the Guatemalan players start. The southern one is a place that they have fortified. It's another base. And then that middle area is a mining complex uh, that they guard because it provides their country with income. Now, another thing to note is uh, in the town of Sao Dominigos, uh, there are currently four trucks that are loaded with supplies from the mine. Uh, we have a large force of rebels uh, stationed outside of the town to, again, run additional distraction for you guys. Uh, but their signal is going to be if you destroy those trucks in Sao Domingos. Uh, by the time you deploy and start doing that operation, we suspect the enemy garrison on that northern fob to be down uh, doing the operation at Nutar. So, you know, we're trying to keep them out of position for you because this will then send them up to Sao Domingos as you guys move into the uh, jail site and rescue, we believe, four CIA operatives that are in the uh, jail complex. Is this making any sense so far? Mm -hmm. Yes. One okay. Question. Yep. I'll wait. Okay. Uh, after you rescue those four guys, you're going to notice there's a green LZ marker. That is where we have a boat waiting uh, it's an RHI, uh, RHIB rubber dinghy. It's an RHS one, so it has five slots instead of four. So you're going to load the four dudes in that boat. There's a driver waiting there as well. Uh, and then you are going to basically get out of the AO. I would recommend swimming across the channel uh, 2.5, which is, you know, about a 400, 500 meter swim. But you're free to try to blend in uh, any way you can. Uh, just get out of the AO itself. Uh, that's because by then uh, we suspect that the enemy... Uh, garrison that's been moving around will be sent back to the uh, jail site to try to capture you guys. So it's all about timing here. Right -o. Uh, to destroy those vehicles, we don't have any explosive charges or anything like that. I mean, you have a Carl Gustav, you have PTRSs. Explosives in the arsenal. There are explosives in the arsenal. There were? I didn't see any. Okay. Yeah, there were. Uh, okay, I think 
So hold on, he was take out trucks, rescue, and GTFO. Yep. Pretty much. And we got to avoid the players, which will be at that spot. So I mean, you can you can avoid the players. I'd recommend it because they're gonna have more people than you. But uh, you know, you do you. And again, this is one of those ops where it's not meant to have PVP, but PVP can be a possibility. <laughs> That's how a lot of these ops are gonna go. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I did. But that one, that was one of two ops where I actually meant for PVP to eventually happen. This one, I don't mean for PVP to happen. But it's still a possibility. Hey, let's not hunt them. Most mops, uh, most ops are gonna play like today's op, not last week's op. Is right, what I'm I trying to say. Battery, so I'm All go right. I will. Um, I'll let you guys know uh, when you're ready to go. Unless you want me to deploy you first, then the uh, Guatemalan players, because then they might turn around and shoot at you. But remember, you guys have one life. They don't. Send in goat team six. So um, I will let you know when you guys are clear. Otherwise, I need to go and teleport and give them the brief. I'll be on 5-0. 5-0 is a debug net. Uh, I'm going to tell them that as well. Um, so make sure you set your own nets. Uh, I didn't see any radios in our arsenal. Did we? Don't have any. No. Yeah. We only, we only had, we, I don't think, do we even have long ranges? I think we do. No, I didn't see a long range in there. Alright, everyone out. Alright, I guess I just hate you guys. We know. Out, 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 out. Yeah, out. you do. I think Skelly's Skelly, got AFK in the doorway. Out. Oh, for fuck's sake. For sure. Capture him. Hold on, let me capture him. Grenade! Grenade! Oh, Fuck, grenade. Grenade. Uh, Hello, my Guatemalan friends! It's time for your brief! I'm excited! Are you excited? I'm definitely excited. Anyway, now, look at this map. Here is your objective today. First off, I will be on 5-0 if you need me. Uh, what type of LR do you have? Is it an RT? RT-1523. Excellent! Now, uh, out of character, 5-0 is also their LR net for anything debuggy, so maybe have your, uh, you know, stuff coordinate on a different net, wink wink, but, uh, you do you. Anyway, uh, so, uh, map is slightly cut off, we are north of Sao Domingos over at that fob. Today's operation is, we are going to the town of Mater, where we believe there is a bunch of rebel activity, and we are clearing the town. When you get there, do note the uh, end point, which is marked at that uh, other fob position. Uh, that is where I will move respawn to uh, once you start beginning to uh, clear that town out. It's got copies of uh, resupply, extra vix, and all that stuff. Uh, because we never know what the gorillas might do. Now, uh, referencing this map, uh, the fortification marks represent fortified areas. And uh, that service mark in the middle is a mine. Uh, we've been using that to extract a lot of minerals, and it's a really strategic position that we have AI defending. But if anything bad happens, we might call you to defend it as well. Uh, but uh, we'll play this by ear, so uh, <clears throat> 50 check. Spice break. Uh, uh, let me let me try that again. <clears throat> 50 check. Joking. 50 check. Go check 50. There you go. Okay, so I will give you orders off 50 if something happens, okay? That's how we communicate. I'll also let you know when your spawn moves, okay? Okay, firm. Cool. Now, uh, I gotta make sure that everyone is ready before I let you guys out, so um, I'll let you know. Uh, and yeah, so just chill, because I know we still have, uh, I think, a few people trying to join. So, uh, stand by. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Okay, bye. Did you guys hear about the guy who, um, tried to sue an airline for losing his luggage? No! What? No! No! What what the freaking no! Dude. Oh my god. Ah! Yo, no execution, Sushi. Yo, Richard. Please, just once. No. You know, I need a, Fuck. need a new pair of shoes. Lucky New Year? No. Why are you red? What? Do you wanna know why? Because... Well, you're you're what? Well, well, He's well, moving to change the fucking okay, M14. I'm not giving you a gun that started development in 1954 that did not get produced until 1959 in a 1953 operation. You are getting the shittiest one and you're going to like it or else I'm going to take it away, you unprivileged, spoiled brat! Thank you for the M1 Grand. It's the best gun ever made. This is why we can't have nice. Do things. we not have M1 grands in the freaking arsenal? <laughs> I don't know. 
I'm just here to trigger away. you. Oh, I'd like a number nine, and number five. Like <laughs> Large coke. Ah! <laughs> 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 oh, excuse me. T90, please. Um, so happy I joined. Uh, T1000. Huh? Oh, I'm supposed to be running around with an I'm sorry. Did you say T90? Okay, there we go. Here, have fun. Before it goes place. boom. <laughs> boom. <laughs> Here, sorry, Iceberg. I realize I spawned a regular T90 established in 1992. Here, let me give you this one. It was established in 2016. You know, better armor, right? Better. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I did my research. You're exactly right. God, you better. And the world's gonna end in 2012. Okay, go we all know that. <laughs> it's a shame we don't know how to open it because it's 1953, <laughs> and the keys for it won't be made for another uh, like 60 years. What a shame! Clear back glass. I'm gonna crack this nut open. <laughs> Good. Oh, no. Are you guys ready to go? Well, Iceberg, I don't care about your IRL stuff. Is everyone else yeah. ready to go? Yeah. Uh, no one gonna... cares about your trash waifu too, then. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna, no. I'm gonna switch my. Uh, back to I'm getting away before the lightning bolt. Yeah, I'm gonna get away. Before... Yeah. Bro. <laughs> All right, here you can carry Iceberg around as he gets his food before I teleport him into another dimension. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna clear. All right, here's the. Deal. I'm gonna say you guys are clear to move out. I'm gonna clear Green Four to move out. And we'll go from there, okay? Okay, cool. You're clear to move out. I'll just say that again. Okay. Hello, my Guatemalan friends. You're clear to go to the objective. Have fun. Destroy all rebel forces. Remember, it's 1953. Yay! Well, can you use map for fast travel right here? Wow. No, fast travel does not exist in 1953. You're going to have to wait till I think 1955. That's when we invented teleportation technology. Duh. Uh, let me set my alarm. Everybody call off the up. We gotta wait two years. <laughs> All right, Alpha, where are you? On you. All right, Alpha. Alpha, Alpha? Lads. Silver. Alpha, come to the sound of my voice. Alpha, come to the sound of my voice. Hello, chickens, are you there? Awesome. The laser. Gold what? teams, you're fast boys. Red teams, you're you shoot from afar, boys. Yep, gotcha. So what we're doing is um, we're going to check in on the mines first. And once we've checked in the mines to make sure everything's sound, we're going to regroup with Bravo at the FOB once they've checked in at the radio towers, and then we're going to push them Atari. <coughs> If the mines are reported to ha start having issues, we're going to leave Bravo to... Oh, shit! Emergency! Be advised! The southern outpost is under is attack! Mine, like, as in, you know, resources yes, um, or mines? Yes, a mine that has... Guatemalan guardsmen, you should go defend the southern position like now. Copy. Everybody on yelling. Get out of the base! I don't want the PvP to start. Please. Phoenix Claw, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. I hope you keep enjoying the operations and I hope you get a kick out of this. Yeah. Oh, now it's um, so you don't have a radio reader today? Look, guys, 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 I know you're embedded CIA agents and you get horny, but please use lube when you stick your butt on the fence. Thank you. <laughs> God. Please. Uh, you want my multi -twitch? uh, yeah, uh, shoot me a link for it and I'll, uh, I'll put it on mine. Do we have data with us? Um, sorry, I don't multi Twitch trash.
It's simple. You gotta give me your multi, alright? Alright, let me go to a multi here. And if you guys find any multi twitches, let me know and I'll add them. Well, let's add that to the title. And let me give some additional shout outs as well. Uh, Prince, thanks for the 100 bits. Uh, Third Gun, thank you. Um, Theodore Gunman. I can't call you Theodore. There's no O R E in there. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm, I'm bad at names. But thank you for the 100 bits uh, 15 minutes ago. And let's see how this uh, PvP op does. Let me also add in the title Zeus PvP POV. Even though I don't mean for there to be any PvP. But you never know. I just realized I spelled Iceberg's name wrong. This is why they should send it to me instead of me memorizing it. Because who the hell is Iberg? And let's see. Yanni sent me his. Cool. So that is some of the stream POVs from the T3s. We can get their perspective. Because this is the T3 slot. You know, the op is meant for them. I'm going to put these guys, like, right on top of that position. Hey, Guatemalans. Uh, when you uh, secure the southern fob, I'll uh, move the respawn position up there. Okay? Okay. All right. And this is all set. I just got two uh, squads of infantry guarding that. This guy's head blown off, jeez. And they got a cable tied guy in here, I think, because he's AFK. So what's this op about? This is a play off of the aftermath of the 1953 uh, botched raid of Salama in Guatemala. Uh, this is not officially a historical op because you can't find any evidence about this. However, um, I would assume the CIA would try to send in a rescue effort for the uh, CIA officers that were... Um, embedded in the guerrilla force that were captured so this is just to kind of show that you know the cia will then rescue these uh specific cia guys so there's four of these guys uh that are basically rebel or guerrilla kits without weapons their job is to rescue them bring them to this boat so they can extract and then the um cia will swim across as the player base tries to hunt them down So Joe drove all the way over here and is now going to get slaughtered. Joe is still alive somehow. Good for him. And I'm gonna have these rebel forces kind of fold back. So blue four, I might have to, you know, throw in a few extra units here. They might get out and start attacking. But I mean, like... That doesn't know. I heard take that as a no, so yeah, we just, uh... We're gonna have some fun with this guy. I think I just got shot again. Ah, oh, and they get me. <laughs> so I was gonna try to pick up and steal Joe, but unfortunately that was not the case. Alright, be advised, I am bringing your spawn point up to the southern fob since it is secure now. Get the objective done. Out. And I can bully the T1s because... They're meant to be bullied. And I get shot from the left. Alright, good. Uh, QRF was brought up as well, so I got two garrisoned squads right there. That should be enough by the time these guys should uh, be able to take out 
uh, those trucks right there, and I'll have my QRF run in. So I will set up the four platoons I'm going to send. We'll do it slowly, because it takes a little uh, bit for all those units to render in. And those guys are setting up a detour. What are the factions supposed to be, by the way? So, uh, Green 4 are Guatemalan uh, military. Uh, guerrilla are, or Blue 4 are the guerrillas that uh, overthrew the Guatemalan government in 1953. And the Blue 4 players are CIA. And the Green 4 players are um, Guatemalan military. As well as the Green 4 AI that you see. Uh, what's interesting about this is the U.S. supplied weaponry to both sides. So both sides are using World War II based American arms. Uh, because the whole reason uh, the Guatemal, uh, Guatemala, uh, coup happened was um, a fruit company called the Banana Republic convinced uh, Eisenhower and Truman that uh, the Guatemalans were communist, and they weren't. <laughs> it was just uh, capitalism at its finest. So I just blew some poor bastard away. Do they keep peeking that corner? I'm gonna keep suppressing. So you can see his body a little to the left of my uh, reticle right there. And I just killed somebody else. And I shot up somebody else as well. So even though I'm reloading, they're still trying to get me. Poke out again, I dare you. Oh, they got me. Not sure if I, uh, got him, though. Yeah, he's okay. So I don't know who I just murked right there. Might have seen, I think, Joe respawned. I found, um, I found Leo. Okay, let's do this. Nice. Smoking Otherwise, we got to patrol down here. Uh, I think these guys are aggroed. Are just saying, though, just an extra squad kind of maneuvering around that town. I'm going to bring in a little bit of guerrilla QRF here. Roger. Understood. And now you're hearing the CIA guys starting to engage. So you're hearing all those uh, suppressed M3s, uh, M1A3s, excuse me. So, I, I love the fact that we now have an opportunity to use this gun. They all kitted out in these, except for a few exceptions. But, I just I just find that so funny. So, they're trying to demo these to uh, basically cue the gorillas to uh, move in. But, let's go ahead, teleport back, listen to these guys over here. And they wiped that entire squad. So now they just have to have a Carl Gustav yep. shot happen here. And that was a miss. And that took out everything. So what this is going to make is these squads are going to pull out from this position. And that's going to cue these squads to come in. And begin that assault. Guatemala to beautiful advisor. Send your message. The explosions we're hearing to the north, are they of any significance? 
I will let you know. Uh, let me look out my window. I'll get back to you in a few minutes. So now I'm going to call for ungarrisons of these units. Understood. Them swing around. We got two down right there. Ooh, damn, he D-Dragon got hit right there and he's being mag dumped. Uh, they got quite a few down. Joe's running up on his own. Yeah, they gotta go for headshots with the M3 because it's a really shitty gun. Knowing the T3s, it probably is. I need help. Yeah, so they're, they're saying on comms that the T3s are doing that. <laughs> Guatemalan Garrison, after you are done with this position, we need you to pull back to where we started in Sao Domingos. We have had an explosion. So Joe is down, because he was way ahead of all of his guys. These two guys are down, unfortunately. Nightmare is doing his best to get Devil up. They're all really scattered. Hey! Hey! Viva la rev- Oh, That broke my Zeus again. God damn it. Why is switch unit breaking me? Uh, stand by. You gotta do a hard log for that. Ah, uh, I was gonna try to troll him. Most of them, they've memorized what my voice sounds like, so if they ever hear my voice, they immediately shoot me, and it's the funniest thing. It's gonna walk up to him and go, Hi, Viva la Revolution, and shoot him in the face. Uh, it was a little too late to hop in. No, you can still hop in. All right, excellent. Now we're just oh. joining back in. Yeah, the voice. I, I've got a pretty gay voice, let's be honest. <laughs> uh, what mods have CSB, I assume? Yes. There we go. So, um, crap. I probably shouldn't have done that, because now all my units are going to un-garrison on the uh, HQ, and they're, the threes are moving into that position, so... Ah, I'm gonna have to quickly regarrison that stuff. So before the uh, units kind of switch over, bring everything back around. So these guys looks like they fought through a squad right here. You're seeing some grenades getting tossed. And Frost gets dropped by that guy. Zeus. Hide. This is Guatemalan Highcom back on five zero. On the way. Guatemalan ground, are you okay? I am now. I got shot by Colt forty five. Oh, that is bad. Anyway, major fights happening in South Domingos. We we might need your help. Actually, no, we will need your help. Copy that. End route. Oh, I smell burgers downstairs. Ah, oh, my stomach. My fat ass. Copy that. Welcome. Copy. So they're essentially cutting QRF and stuff. Let me see if this guy's still alive. He is. Oh, he's a marksman. Bob, Bravo, what 
What's your status? <laughs> oh, wrong chat. <laughs> like, ha! Let me get on the rooftop and take him down. <laughs> anyway, that's how Liru died. Make sure they wake up. Stop the hacking. I got his arm. Got his wound. Got his wound. I'll uh, remove the pen again. Yeah, so those guys are set to limited. That's why they're being so slow. He got blood and a uh, heavy in him. On the way. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Right, okay. Wake up soon. Giving blood, blood pressure, not blood pressure, heart rate. Last turn again. Okay. Yeah, there blood we pressure. go. Just gonna pick him up. Let's I, I go. The heart rate, he's fine. He'll look up. M13, M13 coming. We need to move. There we go. He's out. Hands up. Hands up. We need to move. Steez, steez, steez. Hey, someone grab me. I gotta run. Got you. Hold. Ready? There. So they're gonna grab Iceberg and move. They're hearing this Vic drive by, so they need to now go very, very quick. You got this other squad of Guatemalan QRF coming in. And I'm gonna quickly just uh, grab this gun and kill off a few of the enemy AI. <laughs> so yeah, just making even trades with the AI. Oh, please tell me that didn't just break my, uh, my Zeus. It might have. The machine gunners, ironically, okay, good, it didn't. Um, they all have M250 cals to set up. But the AI don't seem to, like, setting them up. So, uh, now we have, uh, some of the green four, uh, players have moved back in the town. They're gonna be fighting off some of this guerrilla force. Pretty much a Charlie Foxtrot situation uh, in here. 10 out of 10 aim right there, right? <laughs> uh, do you just hear it? Maybe. The Liru girl scream. Okay. But there's still, you know, a sizable amount of people that they gotta fight Pleasure through. Check. Good check. This is Alpha 5AC. I see. Alpha's pretty much got super fucked. Squad lead down. Going back with Bravo. So I think, uh, yeah, they're saying Alpha 5 IC, geez. So uh, some of the Guatemalan guys are getting pretty oofed, but should be okay from the most part. And I always have a debug squad up here. Just gonna send another squad. And call in another two guerrilla squads to uh, help run the interference here. On the way. Copy that. To the mine. I'm also going to grab an ambient animation, uh, set this to false, have these guys go to uh, hiding civilians, double click this group. Uh, Lambert loaded TSP T1 add-ons, CAC. Not supposed to do that, because that is for Saturday Ops exclusively, because that's where we play with fun mods like Half-Life and stuff. Anyway, uh, they're moving on from these bodies, so I can go ahead and delete them. So, keeping the server clean a little bit. Meanwhile, Green 4, uh, are still moving around. Put more AI down. They're doing their best here. Now I'm gonna just RC one more thing. Owie. And then we'll go look at the uh, CIA players. You a gorilla? You don't look like a gorilla. So I think that uh, compound's now clear for the most part. Yeah, you just have that two-man going. Why are these guys still set to friendly? 
Seen a lot of grenades getting popped here. Ay ay ay. Some of the Green Four guys are just running around on their own, pretty discouraged. And we'll see what these guys do. They might try to get on the southern side. And these guys got deployed down here. I don't know for what, because all the fight's happening up here. So now you're starting to see KIA. Any forces on this net recommend we all reconsolidate and then try to take back the town of Sao Domingos. A lot of our men are down at this point. Over. Are you Guatemala man or a CIA man now? What? What about the CIA? <laughs> That's not funny. I've completely lost contact with everyone in Sao Domingos, so please go fucking rescue them. I don't know. So yeah, this is a mix of both players and AI on both teams. Again, possibility of PvP, but this is one of those ops where it's not entirely designed for it to happen. Compared to last week's op where there was a shit ton of PvP. Dismount, right? I don't know what that was. I'm just that was just disappointment, okay? <laughs> That's what it was. It was freaking disappointment. Solid yeah, the grill attack, it's starting to run out of steam. You throw grenades at me! <laughs> I throw a grenade, he throws a grenade, he throws a grenade! <laughs> like. <laughs> grenade, grenade, grenade! Oh, uh, this is Alpha. Trying to get uh, sorted again. Now it looks like the bulk of the Guatemalans have uh, regrouped here. Oh man, some of the stuff you see in Arma 3, it makes you really shake your head. For me, I just laugh about it because it happens all of the damn time. But when players, you see them doing stuff like that, that means, you know, they're kind of in too deep. They don't have enough guys to pull security from and it's all just really falling apart. But threes need to make their move soon. I get they're being slow and stealthy, but the guerrilla force is starting to run out of steam here. And there's only so much I'll be able to PvP against these guys. I think both of our aims suck. This gun, this gun is not, it's uh, it's a bitch to aim. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> On the way. So I'm gonna try to have all these AI kind of consolidate in the middle. Send those guys back.
Gonna break all these guys apart. Set them to full. It's gonna break all the AI apart it's, uh, as well. And I think I'm gonna do one more squad of guerrilla forces just to come from the... Uh, from that position. Now let's teleport over here. Let's listen to these guys locally. As they move up. I've ungarrisoned the other squads they're fighting. Yeah, Let me pack. Oh, no, no. Thank you. Oh, okay, thank you. Okay. Missing all those shots. Take it five Over in that balcony. Fifty percent. On the corner of that building. Take the 70, 80, 90. You good? Go. Thank you. They're calling him out as possible players. You good? No, fine. Standing orders for all Guatemalan forces. First, we need the outpost north of Sao Domingos retaken. After that, radio it in and I will drop a respawn point and then I will give a second set of orders. Over. Guatemala, Dapi. We love bananas. But it was the fruit company that started all this shit. So I was hoping to try to go over the wall and got tapped by this M1 Garand guy. That's why it's dangerous to go over the wall. Yanni's down. Guatemala's a beautiful advisor. It is good down here on me. Send message. Are the positions to our east under attack? We'll get to that, but first we need to clear out the northern position. So I can give you a respawn point and you can consolidate. Copy that. So the quicker you get it done, the quicker you can then go to the east. I still need out, help out here, guys. I'll leave you here. So all four hostages still alive, uh, I think. Nope, one is KIA, unfortunately. So they're trying to medic him, but he is—he is dead. Give me your blood. Copy that. Good. Okay. Okay. Someone's saying they think they uh, uh he, he got Yeah, cause this and Tempestal <laughs> shot one of them. Oh no. Yes, we have a we have Janeski in this up. And he is on the multi twitch. Oh, I got hit in the leg. Dead. <laughs> the truck ready to fuck up. Go, 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 go. Welcome. I'm up. Blowing the other truck. We've not been. The sights on the grease gun are just malicious. So I think they're trying to get him in the other truck because they couldn't get the guys in the...
Um. I can't move fast, guys. I need help. Got crossed over here as well. And they left one of the captives! I'll have to yep. do it at my partner. Give me a sec, I'm limbing, guys. Hey, Wait, Nam, I'm, I'm your subconscious. Hey, dude. You only, uh, you only rescued three of them. There's still a fourth one back there. Supreme Commander. This is Supreme Commander. Send message. Aside from the one guy shooting at us, we are secured. Okay, no one's shooting at us. Ah, yes, you killed the Vincer. Uh, I don't know why you did that. It wasn't me, that's for sure. Alright, so he's re-secured that position. Now, I'm not sure if you heard the explosions to the southeast at those positions, but they are, uh... Yeah, go go check out what that is. I lost contact with all of them. Copy! It's Woods! It's Woods! So a small disconnect is uh, Yanni left. I think he cooked off and died in the Vic. We're not gonna swim because officers are dead. Should we go back and take off the rest on? Hi! Hostages are dead. Are oh. Alive? Hello? Are that, uh, what the fuck? That's my boat. That truck blew up from the fucking nature. Fucking nature's deadly. Just get the boat together. Grab everybody else. The, this was for the hostages. They're, They're dead. dead. No, it's ours. Oh. No, that's not how this works. I'm swimming. Where were you swimming? I'll get the other two. Are you hostages? No, they all died. Wait. Actually, you left one, but whatever. That's never a good sign. Yeah. Get out of my boat. Roger. Copy. Welcome. Uh, we're moving to the east. Hi, yes, hello. I was simply a bit armored on the bush. Ah, uh, hi. Yes, hello. I mean, I I don't know if you guys were forgetting about me, but I'm a I'm a CIA operative. You've almost left me behind. That would have been awkward. It would have been really awkward considering I saw you die in an explosion. Uh, no, I was one that you literally left from the compound. Yeah, awkward. Like oh, you literally cool. forgot about me. Yeah. Someone
It's like, yeah, that would have been awkward. <laughs> so we might have about a PvP. Because the player base is finally catching up. <clears throat> it's gonna be close. Oh, it's spotted! They're spotted! And he just completely whiffed those 50s! It's a 50 cal fight! See, this guy, group, I don't know why they're not telling them, hey, we just saw bad people leave. But it looks like they're gonna... On the way. On the way. They're gonna ditch them. Iceberg and Skelly are being dropped off with the Carl oh. Gustav, in case they keep driving in. Oh, I'm trying to I'm trying to get up to where the hostage is. Oh, well, this is awkward. Guatemala to advisor guy. Oh, hold on. Out of character. Yeah, send message. Everybody is dead at the eastern compound. Bravo squad is in, is in pursuit of a enemy truck that was found fleeing the scene. They're attempting to murder its occupants now. Yeah, I don't know. We'll address that in debrief. All right. Well, I guess pursue and engage if you find any leads. Otherwise, we uh, might have to index soon. Hey, firm. We're on our way to Matari as well. Okay. So, uh, I have a little button. It's called a, a, the CIA. They call it a pager. I paged the boat guy because he thought everyone was dead, and he's coming back now. I just heard a gunshot. Did you hear a gunshot? I don't know, but I have a rocket, and I'm very finicky with it. Ah. Want to get on the 50 cal and do some shooting? Uh, I, I would, but I am 50 cal intolerant. You also might need to load me into the boat. Uh, by the way, the boat guy just said he took a shot. He's very quick with his pager. Uh, okay, fine. I'll page him. Gotta be careful because there's an entire squad here. Okay, back to the truck, back to the truck. Iceberg run! He's trying to pop a smoke to conceal him! Oh, he's getting shot up!
Just popped a German grenade. I think he's gonna try to crawl somewhere to bandage. Caleb's still alive. He's laying low. Well, I think Slushy's gonna pull back. Iceberg, he's gonna hide right in the smoke bloom. Probably try to bandage. Skelly, he's got prone launcher out. He's trying to adjust. His trucks are right there. Looks like he might try to reposition instead. Oh no. Skelly dropping them both with an STG-44. They found Iceberg, they took him down. And Skelly, I think he just got shot in the legs. So Chab is trying to bandage. He gets pit shot down as well. <laughs> Underscore, he's hearing those shots. He's looking in that direction. He is painting on Skelly's position. Man, just to get him. Yes, my friend, the boat is on the way. Are you hurt? Yes, I, uh, I transmitted our position in Morse code based off of what I learned in CIA school. Also, I learned how to throw my voice, which is why I'm whispering in your ear, yet I'm in front of you. It's amazing what you can learn in school. Stay in school, kids. My buddies at least swim all the way? Uh, they are almost to the other end. I knew it was going to take at least 10, 15 minutes to fucking swim all the way. Well, the point was, like, we'd be indexing at that point, but three of you stayed behind, and yeah, it's a, I have to keep it going because, you know, PvP. Fucking truck hit tree blew up. That's yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, I've seen the other trucks hitting trees fine, so I don't know why yours cooked off specifically. So it's I guess it's just an anomaly. This one, I hit a shit ton of them, and I'm still fine. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Guatemalan engineering. Even though that means it's U.S. engineering, but still. I know. Iceberg woke up. Iceberg was captured. No. All right. I forget capture. Yep. I go back there and kill. We're not killing woods. All right, no so like break. Uh, so that lawn swim for the CIA wasn't supposed to happen. That would be like the point where you know we'd index, but because three people were still in the AO, uh, we ended up having a bout of PvP. So I apologize if that last swim was uh, boring. Uh, I also don't know what cooked the car off. I watched other, uh, excuse me, the truck. I watched other trucks uh, ram a bunch of trees and stuff and be fine. So I'll just chalk that to bad luck. So it was grenades. It had a delayed cook off. Ah, that would be it then. Okay. Uh, otherwise, yeah. Um, Skelly and Iceberg stayed behind. Uh, tried to kill some dudes. Uh, Kalen was able to grab the one HVI that was forgotten about. Uh, I actually had him like uncable tie, run up to the two guys still in the AO, and say, "Hey, you forgot about me." So we ended up rescuing him because the other three got blown up, or two got blown up. One was accidentally shot. 
Uh, I did provide the kits of everything that they'd be wearing uh, at your start, so it's okay. I probably just ricochet or something. But uh, otherwise, yeah. Um, again, there wasn't supposed to be any PvP in this one, but it was still a possibility. And eventually, the um, Guatemalan Zeri group finally pushed the prison and still found a few dudes, and we had a nice little car chase for a good 30 seconds. So, yeah, hope you guys had fun. Uh, CIA, we'll start with you since it's Tier 3 up. Uh, anything to say? They did not capture me, as they shot me right at the end. Ah, okay, so he is that now is dead. That is true. Uh, I'd like to point out, we got a little too panicky at the end there in the uh, prison. I don't know why wasn't I fully medic before people started ditching. Like, I'm very confused as to what the fuck happened at the end there. We found those trucks, and we were like, we're that's going to make it a lot easier than having to run. So, Are you... uh, they naded, they put some, one, there was like two dudes running around, they tossed some nades near the truck, and I was like, we're at time to get the fuck out, and then one exploded right under the engine, so I, we were able to drive for a bit longer, than the truck just fucking exploded. Yeah, John, you were loaded into the other truck. And then it was just game over. Oh, I was in the truck while it exploded? No, 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 you were in the second one, we got you to the, uh, boat, um, but yeah, then, yeah, I suppose you died at that point. A lot yeah, of us I was were unconscious. I, I kept telling, was anyone medicking while I was in the truck? And no one apparently did, so thanks. Either way, I'm done. Alright, uh, anything else from CIA? Someone might, whoever was sort of squad leading might want to, well, okay. We went, went into the town, we blew the trucks up, killed some AI, fucked off, hit a patrol north side of the mine, killed it, medicked ourselves up, went up to the prison, attacked it from the south side, and shit happened, and yeah. Could have gone better, but at least we got one, I guess. And no one got captured because death pills. Hmm? Anyone else anyone else got something? Oh. Oh, they cheated when the thing exploded. Yes, we 100% rigged that to explode. Set charge to 10 minutes, huh? Mm hmm. Definitely. I mean, I understand, Skelly, but I, there's nothing I can do to fix that. It, it you know what I mean? Cook yeah, like, it was just. It, it just has delays. It's fucking dumb, but. It's like how happens. the crew will bail out and then it blows up five seconds later. It's just how the mechanic works. Yeah. Well, either way, I, I, considering the start was awesome, the end there was a bit clusterfucky. All right, Guatemalan ground command, go. Uh, thank you, my beautiful advisor, for being patient for ground command dying like six times, but you know it's okay. Maybe don't run um, off by yourself then multiple times. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, I'd say it on the whole it went pretty well. Uh, aside for the fact that Alpha Bravo got very disorganized and mixed with each other after the first objective until we managed to regroup at the original FOB. Uh, then we pushed on to the prison, found everything. Alpha found everything there dead. Bravo uh, wound up chasing after. I guess it was the CIA. We thought it was the CIA. Too bad they didn't get to kill you all. That would have been fun, but it's okay. Things happen. Yeah, Alpha. Alpha. Uh, Alpha did pretty good on my part. Uh, at the beginning there, uh, I was driving the Vic. Frames kicked my ass, so I switched out the driver, and then TFAR kicked my ass. So we ended up being stranded in the forest for a pretty decent while, waiting to just be massacred. Uh, we did get massacred, uh, respawned, got in a Vic, went up to uh, Sao Domingo to repel Blue Four forces. We, um... Took a bit to do that, then we regrouped at our base, went to the prison, found everything dead. Um, then we let Bravo chase after that enemy truck while we took the coastline towards uh, Matari. Ended up getting there a little later, but I think Alpha did pretty well for the most part. Uh, Bravo. Uh, uh, so in my opinion, in t the majority of people in TSB do not know how to play correctly when they don't have a little handheld radio to talk to people. So in this op, people in Bravo would run off farther than the uh, audible range, and then they'd get separated, and I wouldn't know where they were. So really, you guys, you just have to stay together as a squad in something like this when only the squad leads have radios. It's just something that has to be learned. 
Yeah, that, 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 yeah, that was also a point I completely forgot about. Um, yeah, you don't have radios. I've said multiple times at the start, stay within my voice range, because you don't have a radio. I do, and I think half the squad was lost at least 90% of the time, because they completely forgot that they cannot... They do not have radios. I cannot talk to them over a 5 kilometer radius. I can only talk to them over a 15 meter radius. So please stay next to your squad leads when you're doing um, early tech op or Cold War ops like this because you don't have personal radios to help you get back to the squad. For Alpha, that mainly just happened when squad lead disappeared because of, you know, disconnect and then the and yeah, guy that far. stepped up afterwards uh, was dead. So there was no one on, it would be on radio for a bit. A lot of people went down, so it was just natural chaos. All right, I'm going to wrap it up here. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow for the finale up for the USVS Iran campaign. And, um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed watching. i got to write out all this documentation now, so thank you so much for watching. Go operate operationally. Enjoy the rest of your day or night. And otherwise, cheers, and have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. Peace.